Hello y'all and welcome to JGO. In JGO, I'm discussing everything new in today's update being the V29.20 update in Fortnite. So the first thing that they have added or changed is that they have changed the Lotto UI a lot. Well, basically how skins work. Basically now, if I, if I tap on a skin, let's say Bush Ranger, he's usually rare rarity. His rarity is missing. Same with every other stin does now not have a rarity besides special outfits being frozen couch uh gaming star wars icon lava all of that stuff still has their rarities also the signs became a uh, slope series that's kind of cool but basically besides uh the special rarities every other stin is now sorted by alphabetical because this is default this is alphabetical the only thing alphabetical does now is add the rarity stins. But if I just go back to default, I will find that the first two stins are the same. For example, Ares is a, is, was originally a rare stin. Artemis is an epic. They're right next to each other, but they both start with A. So it's quite an interesting way to sort the stins because, well, stins don't hold rarity or meaning, meaning they can basically sell the stins for whatever price they feel worthy for. Like, for example, how Zutor and Katara are 3,200 V-Bots. You heard me right, 3,200 V-Bots for two stins with backlinks and pickaxes. 3,200 V-Bots here. I would love to see what a glider costs too. That I would have to pay my soul and a leg. And they're 200, 2,000 separate. How the hell is Fortnite selling these for 2,000 V-Bots each? Are they on crack? So this is this is cheaper than this, and you basically get more. Same with this. Yeah, phone is on crack again. Good to see. Good to see. So yeah, they basically just changed how Lottery UI works. It's quite interesting. I hope they give us rarities back, but they might not. There's also some new weekly stuff. There is new story quests with Aphrodite snapshots that I will put. That I will make a video on. There's new weeklies, so yeah, though that's kind of cool. If you want to do the weeklies, you should because well, you need to do it for the quest awards. As how you originally got the first page is by doing week zero to three of the weeklies. So I'm assuming I would do. I'll just keep doing the weeklies till we have all these pages unlocked in 12 days and 26 days. They have also added, uh, well some new daily discovery basically how daily discovery works is well you just have to earn xp and creative and you'll get more xp you earn sixty thousand, you you'll get a bonus of uh, 18k it's kind of nice it's not the best thing in the world but it's actually pretty decent there's also been a new season for one of the other game modes no one plays this game mode known as rocket racing so if you look here well that's voice track you look here at quests for rocket racing, you can see we have the brand new Neon Rush kickoff quest, and you basically just do, do these quests and unlock, well, some free wheels, and also a bunch of, well, more wheels. They're the same wheel, they're just color variants for one wheel, so that's kind of cool. They've also added new rank, rank quests. I cannot speak goddamn rank, 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 rank quests. So you get some trails, some, like, patterns and decals. It's pretty nice, it's pretty nice. And there's like the dailies for rocket racing still being the same. There should be a starter pack coming I mean, soon for rocket racing. So that's going to be quite nice. They've also added some new stuff in BR. I don't know if we can view our collection book in BR. We can. They've actually added three new NPCs. They've added the Charon NPC up here. He's on the north of Laris Lair and sells a Rift to Joe purple Harbinger SMG. And they have unbolted the Pro Fishing Rod. Pro Fishing Rods can be used to get high rarity fish. They've also added the brand new Nora NPC. She can be found northeast of our fencing fields right here. And also, purely here, she can be found north of, well, fencing fields. And he sells Flowberry, Patch Up, and Proper Size. Nora sells Reaper, Eye, Sniper Rifle that's purple, and Shield Bubble Jr. in stats of two. So that's pretty nice. You also see they have removed the yacht, as Mice has, has said his device and now has, well, vanished. So yeah, that's everything new in today's update. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure, make sure to subscribe, as only 0.8% of you are subscribed. And sorry for my voice, it's a bit weird.